Matt Stairs hasn't announced it to the world just yet, but the native of New Brunswick is on the verge of signing a lucrative deal with the Chunichi Dragons. Japan's still up in the air. I mean, you know, they're definitely interested in me and as in some other players. Um, at this point right now, I'm with the Expo still, and if, if something, you know, happens to come with Japan, then, you know, we'll have to look at the situation and, you know, we'll see what happens from there. With former Cleveland Indian Brooke Jacoby calling it quits, the Dragons are looking at the hard-hitting stairs to replace him. That'd make him the first Canadian ever to play pro ball in Japan. You know, it would be nice. It'd be nice to go over and represent Canada, you know, being the first Canadian to be over there. And, you know, we'll see what happens. It's, uh, you know, there's a lot of opportunities right now, and I'll you know, have to look at and see what the best is for me. Stairs opened this season in a terrible slump. His wife was giving birth, and he couldn't concentrate on his game. But lately, he's been hot, hitting like he did as an expo last season. Usually my concentration is very good. And when I had the opportunity, you know, to play up here, and the baby wasn't born yet, you know, I started thinking about the baby a lot. And my wife, you know, the safety of them. And, you know, once they had the child, then I, had, I could relax a lot more. And, you know, I did concentrate on baseball a lot more. Now, should Matt Stairs eventually find himself in Japan, it'd likely be on loan from the Expos. That way he remains in the organization. The biggest difference is Stairs would make a lot more money, about $300,000, which is about 10 times more than he makes here at home. Rob Sinclair, TSN, in Ottawa.